All right, we leveled up, didn't we? Let's get some skill points in there. Um, we're quite high in the dialogue now. I think that might be getting high enough. We could use to get companions gain 20 armor rating. That's not very good, but at least we can put like five points in there. Get that to 40. Um, probably want to invest in one of these, possibly. Corrosion damage, we don't really need. Tinkering, eh. engineering. I would like to get my long guns up a bit more. No sway for five seconds after each kill. Long gun critical hits ignore 100% armor. I would like that very much. Um, you'll see it's my heavy weapons. I'll get that up to 70. Now we got 209 crit chance on our lung guns and a little bit for our heavy weapons. That'd be good. And perks. I'm tempted to go for the 100k carrying capacity. Though there's the, fit, there's the uh, traveler as well to fast travel while encumbered, which is handy as well. But I think I'm going to go for this one just because it's great. You can carry so much stuff and not have to worry about it. Um, yeah, what we're going to do next, we the last one is this one, but I don't even know if we can go there yet. But let's find out. Maybe we can totally go together. At the workbench, I used to love watching Alex work. Now uh, it's showing nothing. So I presume it's on a planet we don't have access to yet. Otherwise it would show. Yeah, it would show otherwise, I'm pretty sure. But it's not showing where it is, so we can't go there oh, I yet. I like watching you. Uh, so let's do the Ice Palace, maybe? Yeah, that might be interesting. Do that salvage quest first. Um, I do want to get on with the weapons for the void as well. Yeah, the Phineas thing. Because we do need to talk to Phineas as part of this. But I kind of want to check out this. Can we go to this one even? We don't even know if we can go to this one yet. Okay, this one we can go to. So, I guess we're going here first. And then we'll go to Phineas. Phineas's lab. We've reached HRS-1084, Captain. Cool. It's emitting a very weak docking signal. Okay. I almost mislabeled it as normal etheric static. Okay, let's get our uh, companions ready. Uh, I'm probably not going to bring this guy. So let's get rid of his... Replace it with something that's preferably alright. Don't want to give him absolute junk, but I don't want to give him the best stuff. Um... Yeah, I'm not sure who to bring. I suppose uh, Nyoka is one of our... Mm. Let's see. Yeah, I'll probably bring Nyoka and Pavardi, I would think. Where's the weapon I just de, de armed? Shock Cannon Ultra, that sounds fun. Uh, where's that light machine gun? Oh, maybe, I'd, maybe they didn't have an electrified one yet. I should probably make that. Flamethrower's no good. That might be fun. But I think I want to just give them one of those. Because those are extremely good at pumping out damage. And for Malay, we'll give them uh, Can we sort these out? Okay 
decent order of damage. Not really. Um, these are really good. At, at least this one. Shavati already has a light machine gun. That's good. Like, why this does so much more than this? I don't know. Now we just uh, need to give us some decent armor. We'll replace that for that and that for that. Good to go. I think I like the... Um, the light machine guns. Because they... They do consistent damage. Like they don't... They're not like specialized or anything. They just do general damage. Which is nice. Alright. Let's see what the heck happened to you. We don't know what happened to you. So it could be uh... Nothing but the void here, Captain. Oh. I just as soon leave it cold, dark, and derelict. Okay. That noise scared me. I was like... <laughs> Did we fail something? Restricted access. Hmm. Nothing from the window. Something weird's gone on here, that's for sure. That was weird. I got stuck on aim there for a bit. Oh, that doesn't sound good, does it? Well, what we can see is the sentries are down, which means somebody took out the sentries. Obviously. <laughs> so, yeah. This smells of something dodgy. Maybe we can find a clue. What's this? Case of UDL concussive minds. Contents may have shifted in transit. Warranty is void on all detonated minds. Okay. Well, it can't be the mines that did this. That's sealed. Interesting. Oh, there's a little... There's a little uh, scary space there we can go into. Hmm. This all looks very dodgy. Let's have a look down here. See if we can sneakily find out what happened. This is all very spooky. Kind of a little bit concerning that there's no no sign of what happened. Just dead sentries, dead people. Very concerning. Okay, well this takes us up above so we can get some lovely ammunition. That's always good. So this guy died here. We don't know what of. It's not clear what killed him. There's no debris. There's no evidence of bugs. There's a hunting rifle ultra. So he had a sniper rifle up here. Somebody trashed this computer. This is very mysterious. So who killed this guy and how? He kind of points towards something intelligent because he doesn't look like he's being bitten or anything. There's no sign of any bug juice. Okay, so this just takes us up here, I guess. Okay. And there's nothing up else up here? No, it doesn't seem like it. Okay. This, uh, this doesn't take us... No, that just took us up here. Okay. Let's go down. I wonder if we can, like... Ooh, there's a, a mine there. Someone set up a mine for some reason. That will alert... That would have alerted people if anyone was here. We haven't had any response yet. Oh! Permanent compart- <laughs> Mind attributes, no thanks.
Okay. Any others? No, that seems to be it. It's protected by a minefield, which is interesting. That suggests that... Oh, wait, we got some enemy signatures in this room. I don't see them, though. Where are they? Interesting. And what are they? More to the point. Yeah, it looks like we have to go through there as well. Okay. Oh, it's sealed. What the heck? That sucks. So all this way and it's sealed. We can't see what's going on in there. Okay, those are bots. So the enemies are bots? Uh, we ought to keep an eye on these autos. We poke around too much, they might wake up. Okay, so the if the autos wake up, they're gonna not be on our side. Maybe the auto, yeah, maybe the bots ran amok. That's it. That's a good yeah. Unable to access memory cartridge. Terminal below five percent. Restore power mode to the station. Re 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 resume normal terminal. Restore power supply. How do we do that? Um. I think we want, uh, for this job, we want that. If we're going to be up against Max or electronic thingies, we want... This uses uh, heavy ammunition. We want something like this. If, we, if we're up against electronics machines. That's sealed. Is there any way in? Okay, more mines. Right. I was hoping for something more mysterious than machines run amok, but it looks like looks like something like that occurred. Either that, or someone raided this and left. That's also a possibility. Someone came here and left. I don't know. It's weird. It's a weird situation. But nobody's nobody's around except these mechs, so at least what I can tell. And uh, I'm not too worried about mechs causing causing trouble for me. If all I have to worry about is some robots, then we're laughing. Okay, here we are. Let's check the terminal out. What if I generate a normal maintenance log status? Toilet maintenance in the barracks does not flush. Replacement part ordered. Sensors indicate storage tank, yada yada. Repair the toilet. <laughs> That's great. Oh, I see you have activated your holographic shroud, Captain. Excellent. Becoming indistinguishable from an authentic UDL trooper will prove advantageous to your current situation. All right. What's going on? A UDL vessel has been tracking our position and just recently docked with the station. They are patching into the station's transmission lines now. I cannot stop... I've been waiting for this day since we tagged your ship in Cascadia, Captain. I... Wait, who are you? No one told me we had security forces deployed on the station already. Hmm. Uh, smugglers being handed your team is cleared to dock at the station. I guess we go with this and hope it works. Roger that. Just as a precaution, I'm sure you won't mind if we turn on the station security systems. Can't be too careful. 
We hate to leave this location undefended after a close call with outlaws. Hmm. <laughs> I so saw the uh, reactivated the automax your readout must be on delay hmm. that should have been fixed by now as you say we'll just head out then safe travel soldier the UDL gunship is undocking from the station they appear to be departing into space that was easy I'll just try talking more and fighting less seems like it saves on ammunition <laughs> yeah well i didn't need to fight them so why bother all right so we got energy sorted and i've got a disguise now apparently that's sealed Okay, they're gonna attack me now, or do I look okay? No, that's bad. Hmm. You can't even go in that way. Maybe we can open it now. Oh, here we go. Uh, of course, morale is low. You give this PhD tanks and you can scram and gas and a one body system. What do you think it would happen? Once upon a time, there was a princess. And... Mm. Yeah, nothing here really. No. Security routines, maybe? No. No, nothing here. How do we get in there? Can we go in this way now? Well, keep an eye on the floor. Oh, we can pick this. Cool. Ordnance control helmet. What's this? Terminal? Security routines. Disengage checkpoint security. Okay. Requisition. Da, 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 da. Okay, so we deactivated something. That's good. How do we get in there? Will it be open now? All right, we're in. They've been left here. Well, well, well. Subject should not be revived until a method for stabilizing his condition is found. Okay. Hmm. What does the journal say? Grant sublight remote access to the station. Okay. Grant sublight access to the station. That's most important. That's our main objective. That can be dealt with later. Maybe. Ooh, 150 lockpick. Whoa. Come back later for that. <laughs> 150. Damn. Security routines. Modify access. Insert override cartridge. There we go. Mission accomplished. Project summary. Here we go. Further the... Chimeric sciences via the targeted modification of human nuclei using strands obtained from the Halcyon native flora. So they were doing some sort of experiments with uh, chimeric scientists, uh, sciences. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, some shady stuff going on here. We almost lost Charlie. It was a runaway resequencing shift. Once it started, it kept going, spreading beyond the isolated tissue to full-blown 
systemic infiltration. He said it was like every organ was itchy. Mm, told them we'd ice and freeze them to work out how to reverse it. Yeah. Then... Okay, so that's talking about the that's subject done. there. We can go home to the ship, right? Yeah. Ada fierce. Sounds like a plan. Would... Don't we know Chartrain from Cascadia? Maybe we do, but we can't help them. I'm not a doctor, so if I had more medical, I might try to try to help them, but we don't. So let's head on out. Job done. I suppose we could have a look. Maybe. Yeah, I don't know. If I go poking at it, will it kill them? That's the question. That's what I'm worried about. Like if I poke at it, will it will it kill them? I don't know. Nah, that's not the way. Yeah, let's just get out of here. I'm sure whoever takes over the station will uh will handle the matter. Yeah, this is the thing, is there's nothing here saying we had to save them, so we're just gonna let Lilia decide what they're gonna do. Hopefully they can get some medical attention for them, but I don't think we can help. Now that the station's been secured, Lily will be interested in an update. She can be found at the headquarters on the groundbreaker. So yeah, head back to the groundbreaker, job done. It's not really our job to save someone in cryo because like we don't know what their circumstances are we know a little bit but we don't really know enough to revive them Sam, i must confess i have not been clean for far too long yeah right, let's go tell them the good news but yeah if i if i had more in science and doctor i think i might have a look at it but Destination I just reached don't. the groundbreaker i'd probably mess Captain. it up I wish to offer my commendations for convincing the UDL's gunship to leave HRS-1084. I did not favor the idea of being stripped and sold for parts. <laughs> now you're welcome. Let's continue. See what rewards we get for that. It was a nice quick mission. It wasn't particularly difficult. There were some mines there and some robots that could have turned nasty, but we avoided that. And we avoided the... Uh, with the security team that showed up. So, all in all, we did quite well, I thought. I wonder what our next mission will be. Finally, a base of our own. Soon we'll have eyes on every corner of the system. Well done, Captain. Hmm. Base of scientists in suspension tank tanks. Someone might still be alive. I heard about that. While my lawyers scratch their heads wondering how we deal with human salvage, I'm leaving the researchers in hibernation. Aside from the automated security, did you meet any resistance at the station? Hmm. A UDL gunship buzzed the station, but I can convince them to back off. <sighs> I knew it. They've been shadowing us since Monarch, maybe even longer. I've been less than honest with you. Your assignments weren't strictly about the salvage business. You might have figured that out already. Hmm, it's my perception locked. I guess it's not good, isn't it? Hmm. Is this about your cloak and dagger warnings? That's right. Up until now, I've kept you in the dark for your protection. And more importantly, mine. But I'd like to think we've earned each other's trust. After the monarch job, I started connecting the dots. I didn't like the picture. Then what we found at Station 1084 confirmed my fears. You and I have stumbled onto something big. Something none of us were meant to know. 
Hmm. The truth about the human tail, <laughs> you have, you had my interest. Now you have my attention. Glad to know it, Captain. Ask yourself why a skeleton crew was studying that Alta Vitae gas in secret. Ask yourself why stockpiles were hidden on a planet full of monsters. I'm guessing you have an idea. Before we go any further, I want you to keep an open mind. Can you do that for me, Captain? Ah, uh, maybe. <laughs> I can do that. Aliens. I'm talking about aliens. They're the ones responsible for the deaths at 1084, and who knows what else. We have to put a stop to it. Okay. Aliens? Hear me out. I'm saying it's aliens. I'm not asking you to like it. I'm not even asking you to believe it. But I need to act on this threat to the colony, and I can't do it alone. This doesn't feel at all right, Captain. Right. I'm done. I'm officially tuning you out until such time as I hear the words payment and or shooting. The crew is skeptical. That's good. I don't want you walking into the unknown with blindfolds on. I assume you have questions? A few. If we're gonna see this through, I'll need your trust and commitment. Now's the time for setting doubts aside. When you say aliens, what are we talking about here? Conspiracy. One carried out with the help of human collaborators, mm -hmm. assuming they haven't all been replaced. Oh. This is an invasion of our very cells. That damned gas is mixing our nuclein with halcyon biology to twist us, change us, make us more like those monsters on Monarch. Oh, okay. So it's more of a biological experiment then. I haven't seen any evidence of aliens. No kidding. That's how they want it. When I lined up the evidence in my spreadsheet, there was only one possible conclusion looking back at me. This is my data talking, not my anxiety or lack of sleep. Yeah, tell me what needs doing. Dr. Chartrand is the crooked psychopath behind the gas experiments. She sold out her species, and I need you to put a bullet through her skull. Oh. <laughs> why did why did they need to die? Yeah. She's a research scientist and a damn good one. Before UDL poached her, she engineered a 0.2% increase in cysty pig juiciness. Mm. Now she's doing the same thing with humanity. Her fingerprints were all over Station 1084. You saw what she did to her team. Yeah, when did Sublight get so principal? It's cute that you'd think that about me. I just want to add savior of humanity to my resume. I've got ambitions outside of this office, you know. Besides, this way Sublight gets first dibs on alien salvage. Hmm. The lab I passed through didn't seem that evil. Do you usually come across innocent people trapped in suspension tanks? Because some of us would call that excessive. Remember, the tanks were just the shit she left behind. Just imagine the experiments she carted off to her next lab. Hmm. And where does they fit into your alien conspiracy theory? We're far beyond theories. Chartrand's logs, the gas, the suspension tanks. How much proof do you need? Wake up, Captain. An invasion needs collaborators working from the shadows. She has access to the board, unlimited funds, and a colony full of sheep. Hmm.
Yeah, murder isn't covered under my contractor employment agreement. Just think of it as salvaging hope from the smoking wreckage of humanity. This is your initiation into a future with sublight. Want a steady position in our ranks? Buy one with a bullet. What do I get for joining up? Well, there's your usual fee. What else do you want? A promotion? It's yours. Even better. I'll owe you one. All right, then. This key card will get you through the front door of her Byzantium estate. Oh, Byzantium. Don't ask how I got it. You might not like the answer. By now, the other side knows what you're doing. Don't trust anything Chartrand says. She's compromised down to the bone. Maybe even deeper than that. Hmm. I think I'm gonna do a little more investigation and see what's what with that. That sounds a bit spishy. I don't know. Something's not right. But we'll look into it. I'm not gonna just do it just because she says so. Need to uh, need to know what's going on. And right now we don't know anything, so yeah, it's all a bit. Mm, don't like it. <clears throat> it's like we're not really a hired assassin of all things. It's like we're a bit of a bit of a rogue, but no assassin. Uh, so yeah, and that. Let's see what the quest is. Kill Eva Church and key cards. She's she just wants us to go in and kill him. Okay, we're not doing that just yet. I'm gonna do something else first. Anyway, that's all we've got time for, guys. Hope you enjoyed this episode. Till next time.